Illegal tin mining Indonesia has just been shocked by the arrest of Harvey Mois and Helena Lim, who were involved in the PT Timah corruption case whose losses are estimated reached 271 trillion. The problem of illegal tin mining has been going on for decades in Bangka Belitung. There are many methods and they are very complicated. For example, the ESDM and teens have planned in the Arkaab how many thousand tons of tin can be produced this year. For example, 50,000 tons. But it didn't reach its target because a lot of it was taken by illegal miners, both private smelters and artisanal miners who sold their results to companies too. Instead of taking action against this illegal mining, TINS instead buys from them at prices that exceed the standard. Usually TINS individuals are given a kickback by the private sector. Harvey, as the owner of RBT and Helena as the QSE manager at that time, were allegedly responsible for this practice. They facilitate equipment, rental in illegal mining areas, watchful on TikTok.